New report shows Korea's exports in the parts and material sectors will take a serious hit if the country fails to join the multinational trade agreement known as the Trans-Pacific Partnership, or TPP. It says Korea's growing dependence on the global value chain in these industries makes Korea's involvement in the TPP more important than ever. Kim Min-ji reports. Over 13 billion U.S. dollars. That's how much Korea will face in losses in its parts and materials sector in the 10 years after the Trans-Pacific Partnership takes effect, should it fail to join. According to the Korea Economic Research Institute, Korea's growing dependence on the global value chain in such industries will result in an over $11 billion decline in its value-added trade with the U.S. and almost $2 billion with Japan. The figure is equivalent to nearly 20 percent of the export volume of the materials and parts industry within the TPP region. Analysts say if Korea fails to join, it will not be able to take advantage of the massive global network formed in the Asia-Pacific region, which will have a direct and indirect impact on the country's exports in the sector. Although Korea has separate free trade deals with 10 of the 12 TPP member countries, the group has agreed to seek a common set of rules of origin to determine whether a product originates in the TPP region so Korea will lose its competitiveness. The think tank says the government should step up its efforts to quickly join the TPP in order for local companies to boost their business and competitiveness as well as increase their investment and exports. Kim Min-ji, Arirang News.